Hi guys, it's Deanna, your fave stylist. And just recently, I have launched a bounce back campaign, a busy bounce back campaign. If you look on social media, there's a lot of negativity and uncertainty and just confusion all over social media. And what I wanted to do was to help spread a little bit of positivity and instead of focusing so much on what's happening right now and all the negativity i wanted us to try to start putting a focus on how we can support each other when we bounce back from this once in a lifetime setback so what i've done is i've begun to reach out to people that i know are making impacts and that may have businesses or um nonprofits or they just may be you know regular people that are just like you and I that may need a little bit of support whenever this thing bounces back to our new normal so this is it and today I had the great opportunity to interview Miss Debbie Peterson she happens to be one of my clients who is a registered nurse in an intensive care unit at a local hospital here in town as well as she is a young living distributor and in this next clip she's going to share with you what she does how COVID-19 affected her and she's also going to share how she's been coping with it and being able to get through and she's also going to give Give us an opportunity to support her when our new normal allows us to bounce back so you guys pay close attention this story is very very inspiring and i'm really really proud to be able to share it with you it's good to see you it's good to see you i wanted to ask you these questions before oh, you yeah. went so i could share your story and i'm yes. going to send people to your young living page okay okay, okay. so first question is um what do you do you mean for a living yep for a living well i have i mean well i had two things i'm a first uh, i'm an i'm an rn in, in an intensive care unit at a local hospital um right now i work in a covid unit <laughs> taking care of all these covid patients um and i work nights um and I work long hours, <laughs> long hours overnight as a nurse in a medical ICU. That's number one. And number two is I, I am a young a, a distributor for Young Living Essential Oils. And um, I'm working towards that being my full time. Okay. So, um, yeah. I, I, call, I like to call it a, a health and wellness advocate you know okay that's because right now that's what that's what we need we need to stay healthy and well and so i'm trying to um do what i can to do my part to help people stay healthy and well particularly in all this crazy absolutely miss debbie so miss debbie how would you say that um covid 19 affected you and your profession with a registered nurse and your young living essential oils business well you know that's funny because sadly because of this i have job security unfortunately you know um we don't have to worry like i'm not gonna lose my job you know what i mean um so it's made me more busy you know um uh i am i mean we've always been essential workers as nurses um but i think even now um we're a little bit higher on that curve you know um mm. thankfully i don't have little ones um or uh, other kids to worry about I, i'm just me so i can be gone from home you know i don't have to be home to um fix dinner or see the kids get lunch or be there when they wake up you know um so it, it hasn't affected me that way like some of my some of my co-workers that have kids they're trying to find that balance it's difficult um but um but i'm there i'm needed um so it just made me more, I think, more aware of 
what my profession is supposed to be. Okay. Um, so it's made me more aware of what, it, of what my job is and what my calling is, you know, it's, um, and you can see it, you know, I mean, you can always see that we're there to help people, but right now, um, particularly with, for instance, you can't visit your loved ones in the hospital. Yeah. You know, so we have to do things to try to, to try to make families feel less isolated, you know, um, and less um, disenfranchised because they can't see their mom or dad who's dying, you know. Yeah. Um, families feel like, you know, my mom is dying alone, you know, and it's sad. So we have to come up with creative ways to make people feel comfortable. Yeah. You know? um, so we try to do that. Um, it's so it's it changed that way. It's um, it's made me more aware of myself, um, of how important it is for me to take care of me first. Because if I can't take care of me, I can't take care of you. Right. You know. So um, I have to stay well. Um, and so it's, it's. I think that's has been even more pronounced with me. Um, is I know that I really have to. I have to keep my immune system. Um, well, because I can't afford to get sick. Yeah, you know. So, so it's it's heightened that awareness for me. Um, as far as Young Living goes, kind of the same thing. It has made me want to help people more. Like um, it's the it's like for for a lot of us right now, money is kind of like over there. You know, what we're wanting to do is is get things into the hands of people. You know. If you can't buy it, let me give it to you. You know what I mean? Because I need you to have it because you need to be well. Um, there's some of us who have partnered and put our money together to help people who can't afford to buy these things go ahead and get their go ahead and get their uh, their uh, oils or whatever it is that they need to use. And we're putting our money together. Right. To help other people. So it's 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 brought a humanitarian um aspect out more than there was even before. And most most young living people are pretty good about being good good humans, you know. But I think I've seen a I have seen a collective effort um to um to be giving even more so than yeah. before. There's a lot of that going on right now. There's a lot of just giving stuff to people right now. And so and and so I'm looking like for like I said, there's a team of us. So for me, um, I'm ready to to help three people get their get their stuff. You know what I mean? And they can and so we can we can pay for it whenever, you know, however you want. We'll make it, you know, make arrangements. Three months, two months, six months, eight months, whatever, you know, we're not gonna worry yeah. about. I just, I wanna see you get what you need to be healthy. So there's a lot of that going on right now. Okay. So I like that. I love that about, about this company. I do, I love that. And, but doesn't it make you feel good to be able to help somebody else? Cause I think it's healing right now, more so than ever to focus on the wants and needs of somebody else as opposed to just like, how am I gonna survive? I have found that just being able to help somebody else, give somebody a resource or a, a helping hand or just a word of encouragement, it, it kind of helps to keep your uh, sanity throughout all of this. Wouldn't you agree? Yes. Yep. Definitely. Definitely. It does okay. Feel good. Go ahead. Yeah, I, gotta say, I was agreeing with you. It does feel good to be able to, to help other people yeah you know, it does. there's a lot of that going on which is really nice you know um it's nice to see good so miss debbie how can the community help support your bounce back like when all is said and done um is there a website would you like them to go to your young essentials website to support you uh would you like them to just join your um facebook group or how can the community support you the people that are going to see this story on the Mel Virus Hair Studio Instagram and Facebook, how can they support you? Yeah, I think um, I think there are two ways. Um, the, the most important way is probably to to contact me in my Facebook group. Okay. Uh, 
and that is um it's sass and sage mm -hmm. collaborative it's sash s-a-s-h collaborative no, s-a-s-s 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 -S -S. okay sass and sage collaborative okay and that's the facebook page yes and that's my facebook group okay that's my facebook group and uh and just um and just click to join because it's an education group okay you know? and, um, yeah and what i'll do is i will get um i will send i will send you my um my young living link because I don't have it right now, but it's a link, so I'll send it to you, and you okay. can uh, and you can put that in there. That way, people could go if if they wanted to, they could just go to the site and use that link and see um, what they could what they could get. But the personal touch is to would be to um, to contact me and become a, a part of of the, the Facebook group. Okay. All right, guys, so there you heard it up close and personal from Miss Deb Earl Peterson. There's two different ways that we can come together as a community and help support Miss Debbie's bounce back after this once in a lifetime setback is over. Okay, one, you can follow her Facebook group um, and you're going to have to actually join the group okay and so the group is sass collaborate sass and sage collaboration that's s-a-s-s -S -S and s-a-g-e collaborative i'm sorry not collaboration and this is her facebook group where she promotes health and wellness and holistic healing by way of um natural ways of doing that with her young living products they have great products um that like thieves which is their cleaning line it's all natural they have hand sanitizers essential oils diffusers and all of that and then the next thing you can go to an essential road.com that's a-n-e-s-s-e-n-t-i-a-l road.com and follow miss debbie's blog and let's work together as a team and help miss debbie's bounce back be super super bouncy and super super awesome i thank you guys for following male virus hair studio so that you can see this encouraging and inspiring information and if you have a story that you would like to share please please feel free to direct message me you can email me at mhs at melvirushairstudio.com and i would love to share your story how you're coping with um everything that we have going on right now as far as the lockdown and COVID 19 what you're doing to help someone else and what the community can do to help you with your bounce back thank you guys for following and i'll see you on the next video